Hey, it's John of John's PC Hut. Today I'm going to show you how to find out basic information about your computer. And the best way to do that is to view the Windows System Property screen. Now that's what I have open in front of you right now. And by viewing the Systems Property window, you can find out basic information about your computer. For instance, the addition of Windows that you are running. At this point I am running Windows 7 Professional and I also have installed Service Pack 1. And if you move down a little bit it will give you various system or hardware information about your computer. For instance in this case I am uh, on a custom desktop, a desktop that I built myself and what it's basically showing me is the manufacturer of the motherboard and the motherboard model. Had this been a brand PC such as Dell or HP, it would show HP or Dell in the manufacturer section and it will show the model type of the computer. What you can also find out is the Windows Experience Index of your computer and that's this uh, 3.9 right now. This would be much higher. I believe it's the video card that's pulling it down. We'll also show you the type of processor that you're using. In this case, I am running an AMD Phenom. X4 basically means that it's a quad core. The amount of installed memory or RAM, RAM is short for random access memory. I have 8 gig installed, but the machine is only using about 3.25 and the reason it's only using 3.25 is simply because of the system type. In this case this is the 32-bit version of Windows as opposed to the 64-bit. Had this been the 64-bit it would use a lot more of this 8 gig. Um, it also gives you computer name, domain, and work group settings and this is basically networking information for your your, com your, your home network or your business network. In this case there's a computer name, there is the work group information or the network information and also below that is Windows activation. Now I'm purposely hiding the product ID but as you can see Windows is activated and right here you can see the the genuine Windows activation logo. So that's basically the information that's in your Windows Systems property screen. I'm going to show you a couple of ways how I got to this screen or how you bring it up. So let me close it. The easiest way to do it is to click the Start button, then click on the Computer selection, and then click on System Properties. And there you have it. Now I'm going to show you a tip. Now one of the things I like to do on my desktops is I like to show that computer icon on the desktop and I'll show you how to do that. You click on start, you go to computer, then you right click on it and you click show on desktop and what that will do is that will allow that computer icon to be displayed on the desktop. Now if you want to get to that systems property screen all you have to do is right click on that, you can click on properties and there you have it. Um, there's another way you can do that if you want to do it an extra step. I can't imagine why you want to do that, but you'd right click, click open. That'll open the My Computer icon and then come back up to the System Property tab. And there you have it. So that's how you activate the, or how you get to the basic information on your computer. I'm going to close that. And this is John of John's PC Hut, and that has been your tip for the day. Take care.